I made an animated show in 30 days. Everything from story writing, dubbing to animation. How did it turn out? Well, there you go. Hey, I found a treasure map. This is a good time to make them believe in my psychic abilities. My instincts suggest that the map has relations with the Arabic Sea from hundreds of years ago. This is Laddie and everyone knows that he has psychic abilities. It's just that he likes to keep them to himself. Where did you find it? It was at the back of my conflicts packet. You should check the expiry dates first. And instructions too, it's meant to be consumed with milk. This is B guy and he can hold a lot of things in his backpack. Hmm, pretty similar to London. We what? It's just a puzzle at the back of a conflicts packet. A, a really old conflicts packet. Don't worry, I can digest anything. Very well said, Freddy can digest anything. Maybe that's why there are two fishes in our room for the last three months. Jeffy and Jello are my pets. They just like to sleep a lot. Maybe they are hungry. So we should start by sending reports to the Navigator General, right? And all three of them work for GTA, the Global Treasure Hunting Association. They go on expeditions to find treasure for the welfare of the world. They keep the treasure to themselves though, it's just the intention that counts. Hello, my name is Navigator General and I Hello am Navigator General, we made a breaking discovery of a map. Should we start the search? GTA. And you'll be hearing from me soon. Hello, my name is Navigator General. Yes? Thanks for your permission. He said yes. Pack your bags. We're going to Japan. But you just said it resembles London. Exactly. What exactly? Exactly. But... Alright, so we have to reach the airport by 7 a.m., right? Did anyone notice that it took us three terribly animated shots to reach Japan and it's still daytime? It's cause we're animated, no one will notice. So this is the mountain of treasure and it's called the mountain of treasure. Wait, if it's called the mountain of treasure, then why didn't anyone try to find the treasure before? It's Japan, you know, no one understands English. But what about exactly? If there's exactly. So how are we gonna get up there? You have a rope in your backpack? Who carries a rope in treasure hunting trip? I have an escalator though. Man, that's a big escalator. How do you carry it around? In my backpack. Huh, obviously. But it has to be heavy. No, I actually put the elevator in my backpack. And now my backpack has to bear all the weight. I just hold on to the bag. It's light. That's not how it works, you see. According to the third law of nature, make sure to hold on to the bar well. It might be a little shaky. So there you have it. We are at the top of the mountain. Well, congratulations. Sometimes my name is calculations result in disastrous outcomes. It's a mountain you see. You have to travel some horizontal distance with vertical. Didn't really think of that. Guess we'll have to climb it anyways. I got you. Look, there's a person standing there by the pole. Let's ask him about the treasure. He might help us out find the treasure instead of doing it himself. Hey mister, I'm sorry to bother you but there is no trace or evidence of treasure around this area. Go back if you are looking for a treasure. You won't find it. Did he hear us from that far? No, I'm deaf. For how long have you been standing here? 
For ages, I have been standing here. It all started in the winters. I was sledging with my dogs and saw an ice cream seller. I tied my dogs to this pole and went on to get some ice cream. In the winters, of course. But as I returned, all my dogs had already left. I was scared. I searched for them everywhere I could, but I could not find them. That day, I decided to find a treasure around this place. I promised myself that I will find a treasure and live the rest of my life with extreme comfort and luxury. I tried, but I couldn't find it. So I'm standing here waiting for my dogs that someday they will return and will return to home together because I cannot go home without them. He does not know the way back to his own home. Even to this day, I hear the sound of my dogs running in the open field, the sound of the ice cream bell and my sledge sliding against the snow. It's only really been three days. See, it's crystal clear now. There is no treasure on this mountain. Yes, and all that travel was in vain. I shouldn't have come here to begin with. And I'm hungry now. Well, at least we have the packet of conflicts. Let me see the instructions first. It's meant to be consumed with milk. Where are you gonna find milk on this mountain? Never mind. Instructions to claim your award for 10 million dollars. Follow the map below in London. Oh no, this whole time we're in Japan and the treasure is in London. Come on, let's go, it's not too late. And that's it. That's the first episode. I hope you liked it. I'll be making a lot more of these videos, so subscribe if you don't want to miss out. Thanks.